shrikes are incredibly fascinating birds. While they may look cute, they are actually quite fierce and use their sharp hooked bills to catch and tear apart prey. In North America, there are two species of shrikes, the loggerhead and the northern. At first glance, these two species look remarkably similar, but when taking into account a few ID features, it becomes significantly easier to distinguish one from the other. One of the first things to keep in mind about these two species is that they each have a slightly different range. The loggerhead shrike inhabits most of the southern U.S. and Mexico throughout most of the year. Some of them migrate north during the breeding months and can go as far north as Canada. As its name suggests, the northern shrike spends most of its time in the northern parts of the continent. They summer in Canada and Alaska, coming down into the lower 48 states during winter. It can be possible to determine which species is most likely based on location, but in many instances both species may be around as their ranges overlap during certain times of the year. The first physical trait to note when trying to tell these birds apart is size. Loggerhead shrikes are slightly smaller on average, with a length between 20 and 23 centimeters, and a wingspan between 28 and 32 centimeters. They will also appear to have a larger head compared to their body. The northern shrike has an average length between 23 and 24 centimeters, and a wingspan between 30 and 35 centimeters, making it slightly larger than the loggerhead. In terms of field marks, the bill is one thing that can be used to tell these two species apart with some reliability. Loggerhead shrikes typically have a completely black bill, while northern shrikes typically have lighter colors at the base of the bill. Others have also stated that northern shrikes have a larger bill than loggerhead shrikes, but this may be subjective. The black mask covering the eyes of these two species is one of the most useful things to look at when trying to discern which species you're seeing. The loggerhead shrike has a thick mask that goes from the base of the bill to well past the eye. Northern shrikes also have a black mask, but it is noticeably thinner than that of the loggerhead. This thin mask of the northern shrike shows white above the eye that is either lesser or non-existent in loggerheads. Another way to distinguish these two species is by regarding the chest patterning. At first glance, these two species appear to have the same colors on their chest, but they're actually noticeably different when taking a closer look. The loggerhead shrike has a clean white chest and underside, with the exception of juveniles which show more barring. The northern shrike, however, shows faint gray or brown barring as adults. This barring on the chest can be a key feature to look at in the field when making a quick ID. Overall, the loggerhead shrike will be slightly smaller and have an all-black bill, thick black mask, and white underside, making it appear darker with cleaner looking features. The northern shrike will be slightly larger, have a bicolored bill, thin mask with some white visible above it, and a faintly barred chest, making it appear lighter and more frosty. While these two species are certainly very similar in appearance, when taking all of the ID features into account, it becomes significantly easier to make a positive ID. If you found this video helpful, please be sure to like, subscribe, and share. Additionally, if you have suggestions for other ID tips videos, please put them in the comments below. And as always, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time on Badgerland Birding.